Welcome guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can set up your Xiaomi smart speaker with your Android phone. Okay, so we are going to make it by using the Google Home application. So first of all, I can recommend you to go for the Play Store. Go for the search pool type home and just be sure that you update the Google Home application. Next, you can just open this application. When you turn on your speaker, when you plug this cable, it will be turned on automatically. And if you don't have this option to set up your Xiaomi smart speaker, I can recommend you to simply perform the hard reset. After that reset, your speaker will turn to the pairing mode. So we have to click and hold volume down button and the volume up together for at least 10 seconds. The speaker will make sound and also this indicator will turn off. The same with the front screen. So let's make it right now. Click and hold these both buttons and keep holding. Okay, it's not how it works, that's some weird uh, beeps. Let's make it one more time. I probably just uh, remove my finger for a while from uh, the volume up button and that's why it happened. So let's make it one more time. Just keep holding until this indicator turns off, just like that. So if you have the same problem like in my case that you release the button, just just repeat the, the step, okay? And uh, just simply go from the Google Home application and just wait until the speaker makes sound and this indicator turns from the uh, from this color to the yellow. As you can see, in my case, there's even the notification. It was right here for a while that there was this synchronize with the Google apps. So just open the home application one more time. I think right now it will be visible. Okay, right now it's still not here. So we just have to be patient and wait. When you hear this sound, as you can see, here I have the notification that I can set up my Nerby Chromecast device and right now it will appear in the application. As you can see, it takes uh, uh, some time uh, for the people that it wasn't here already, right? But if you simply get it for the first time when you open the app and turn on the speaker, everything will go definitely easier. So right now just click right here to set up this speaker. and. Here we can choose our currently home or we can add another one. You can decide, I'm gonna use this one. So click next. And right now the speaker, I mean the phone and the home application is looking for our Xiaomi smart speaker. So right now we just have to be patient and after a few moments, as you can see, uh, they are synchronized so we can click yes. <clears throat> right now they are connecting. You have to be for sure connected with the Wi-Fi on your smartphone. Okay, did we hear that sound? Yes. Yeah, we can improve the speaker, why not? Now we can pick that it's in the office. Click next. Here we can select right now the Wi-Fi network that we want to be connected. So if you want to switch it, just make it right now because later you just have to make the first setup one more time. So just be sure that you select the correct, correct Wi-Fi network. I'm gonna use this one that it's already selected. So click next. We can use saved passwords. Why not? Click OK. Right now the speaker is connecting to the Wi-Fi. As you can see, it takes some time to connect the speaker to the Wi-Fi. So I guess I'm gonna wait for like one, two minutes. And if it is still not, not working, I'm gonna actually restart the home application. So. I'm gonna forward this video. 
Okay, right now let me just reset the application and we are going to check what is going on. Maybe it's only some kind of the bug and we are already connected. Nope. Looks like we are not. So let's try to repeat this the same step actually. If it is still not working, I'm gonna basically uninstall this app and we are gonna fix it. Okay, let's let's click yes. Okay, and uh, we can try to switch the Wi-Fi. So let me just connect for this one, actually. Let's see if, if it works right now. I'm gonna input the password of my Wi-Fi. Yeah, it's correct, so I'm gonna click connect right now. And let's see if switching the Wi-Fi will make the speaker connect to the Wi-Fi. Click connect right now, click done. Okay, never mind. We just have to manually connect our phone to the speaker and we just have to open the Wi-Fi settings. And as you can see, we have to select Mi Smart Speaker. Okay, so as you can see from the previously setup, something changed. So there was this notification and that also the LED that just turns, I mean the change color. Okay, and we are connected back for, we are connected back. And there's a notification, we have to connect the speaker. Okay, let's click to try again. But it looks like we are connected for the GSM center, as you can see. Okay, and right now we are connected. So that was interesting. Uh, I'm just wondering how it looks in your case, because in my case, as you can see, it takes a lot of time. But when I switch the Wi-Fi, it finally works. So if you have the same problem with the connection, like in my case, uh, you can just repeat the steps. And yeah, that's all. When we will be connected, uh, this LD will also change and we'll also hear this notification sound. Click next. Right now we can pick the default music service. I'm gonna stay with the YouTube music. Link video services, uh, we got the Netflix. Get started with the voice calls, so we can just talk to our speaker and make the voice calls. Okay, and that's also my number phone that we are with a Google Duo and we can make call over the Wi-Fi without using the mobile data. We can add the household contacts and we can stay up to date to the latest features. I guess we can just skip that. Okay, it's almost finished. That's the sum up of the setup. Click continue. We can turn on the microphone. Click more. Hi, I'm your Google Assistant. I'm here to help. To learn a few things you can do, continue in the Google Home app. Option. But that was the first setup. That's how we can set the Xiaomi smart speaker with your Google Home application. If you find this video helpful, remember to leave a like, comment and subscribe to our channel.